Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Skeletons. I'm Zinker, he's Derek. And this is Luigi's Mansion 3. Hi. Oh, this oh this card has a cute girl on it. I like this card. What card is it, Derek? World Legacy Struggle, I guess. It's a trap. Oh, yeah, World Legacy... Hey, Wait. Like... No, I, I'm thinking of Trick Stars, I think. Uh, well, anyways, um, the, uh, uh, I, I wasn't, I bought the tent with not, not sure what to really do with it once I got it. Cause like, I just wanted to have it cause it's just cool. It just looks cool. Um, right. uh, I, uh, my old roommate, uh, said that, or had previously said that like, if I, uh, cause like I told him I wanted to get, I, he bought the tent, uh, and right. I watched him open it and I, I saw the tin and I was like, I want the tin, I really want that tin. And he said, he basically told me, like, if you buy a tin, I'll, like, go, like, half, half season, buy the cards off you, uh, or not. And I was like, yeah, that's, uh, uh, I was, and I was like, that's, uh, that's honestly fine. And I didn't buy a tin for a while, uh, but then I did. And I thought, like, oh, I should see if he, and I thought to myself, I should see if he's still up, up on that before I, like, open any of this, any of the packs or anything like that. Um, and then, uh, I have no, I, I realized I have no self-control and then I just opened everything. Nice. Um. So, uh, I just have all these cards just kind of sitting here that I don't really care about. Um. I believe it. But uh, other than, the only one I probably care about, I care. I guess like the Egyptian gods are cool to have, and then like the the blue eyes alternative, because like I guess I can do something with it. If, in, like once a, once a year when I'm up in Connecticut. Yeah. Uh, but um. The uh, what I decided to do with the tin is uh, I'm keeping uh, extra cash that I have from work in it. Uh, oh, but, I could have circumvented to be this uh, thematic. Okay, I I was uh, to, uh, I was trying to be to thematic do, like, a though. Cheese. Okay. I well, not really cheese. I was just curious. Can I not activate the conveyors? What happens if I do? And I realize why something happens later on. We'll get to it when it happens. Mm -hmm. uh, but to uh, to be thematic, all of the uh, the cash that I'm storing in the the gold sarcophagus tin is uh, face down. Okay. What does that do for you? Are you gonna activate well, your cash later you... on? Well, I'm gonna add it to my hand eventually. <laughs> Why are you storing cash in a Yu-Gi-Oh tin? That just seems that just seems like it screams. Come grab this. Well, it's it's, worth it's money. a Yu-Gi-Oh tin. Who's gonna grab it? Yes, exactly. It's the zinker. It's a it's gold. It's a gold sarcophagus. It's it's supposed to hold stuff. So this happens. So you can't bring the key up there as Guiji, which I think is yeah. funny. I f I appreciate them the fact that Luigi or Guigi's weakness to water is exploited several times. Yeah. Spoiler, I guess. Well, can I? Uh... Spoiler alert: They shoot Guigi several times. Can I now bring it up without? Ah. Huh. Well, that that worked. I don't know how it gets Luigi up here, but, uh... Wait. Oh, he didn't give the key. Oh, yeah, he didn't give the key. Say, he can't give the key, can't, that's can't right. You, hand, you, can't, you can't take it from him? You can't hand it no, off? No, because I, I... He's not... Luigi doesn't have to go in anywhere to get the fucking, uh, star. They made this cheese-proof. That's... I like that. I, I like that they figured out how, how to do that. You could have, I think, uh, what? like prevent the conveyors from turning on if you took a very long route around. If you really wanted to. Okay. Then this guy sucks ass, and I really hate him. Hey, right, come on. Oh, wait, what? 
Oh, right, though. I got to... Uh, ah. Hello? Ah, I'm saying, yeah. I don't know why your, what your plan there was. I don't know. What am I doing here? Okay. No, Luigi almost got him! God damn it, Luigi, you're so close! So close to one suck. Couldn't do it fast enough. Alright, where is he? Can't one. You can't. You can't suck it just once. Yeah, I can. Any. But anyways, uh, I I put the cash. I basically I put some some cash I had in the in the gold sarcophagus, and then uh, like right before I left for work, I thought about it and I was like, wait, fuck, that's wrong. I have to put it face down. Nice. But Yu-Gi-Oh cards can also be played face up. Zinker gold sarcophagus. You ex you banish a, a card face down from your deck. Oh. Wait, are you sure it's face down? Oh, yeah. yeah. I don't because your opponent doesn't see what it is. What would be the point? What uh, what else does it do? Oh, you get it back in two turns. All right. Yeah. I gotcha. Ah. Yeah, I will eventually add that cash back to my hand. I see. Okay, that's clever. That's clever. I like it. I want to eventually. I would love. I, one thing I would love to do is I'd love to eventually make like a larger gold sarcophagus, I can't believe like I model can't one. Move. Speed run tech guys. Uh, that apparently getting attacked by bats cancels that. Uh. I guess that doesn't do anything for me. Uh, apparently getting attacked by bats cancels that, uh... Cancels that animation. I just, I just really enjoy the queen. He's just falling down. <laughs> he just walks through there and he just falls. I like how I did it and there was no reason for me to have done it. <laughs> yeah. Just, I did it. Uh, yeah, that's, a, that's right. That's where I should be. Take a peek at the security guard. We didn't do it. Ooh. He's just fondling the elevator button. To be fair, that's what you should do with an elevator button, but... You know. Yeah. I call him police officer and security guard. I don't know why I called him a police officer. Ah! Oh no, it's him! The man made of goo. <laughs> to be fair, he probably has the, the the one. He's like the one ghost with the correct reaction to seeing Luigi. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Luigi's like an own. Also, I like him just. Yeah. <laughs> I like how he actually acted like it hurt him to pick up the the, the fish. Yeah. I, like I thought how this, this is cool. Is literally just a Gooigi boss fight too. Oh right, I have to do yeah. this. Yeah, I thought it was just cool. How I thought it was just cool how he uh. He has a water blast. Just grab. He pulls out a gun. Okay, there we go. I should be able to. I'm definitely gonna two shot him. <laughs> Whoo! Okay. Where are you, buddy? Oh, I forget. Oh no! He didn't get me in the last game. He Ooh. got me in this game. I wasn't ready I didn't for that realize shot. You could just that you could just blow ghosts away. What do you mean? I, oh, I yeah, literally never slam. used that as a, a combatively. Oops! What did I do? Oh, I slammed by accident. I didn't mean to. Jesus! This isn't that hard of a fight. I'm failing so bad. I don't. I don't even know how he does. He even hurt Luigi. No, I don't. I I don't think he can. Uh, that's what I'm saying. I just think it's a Luigi boss battle. I look how he has trouble getting out. Ugh. Yay, the elevator button. No, this section's all about Luigi. Like Luigi's the star of this section. Yeah. <laughs> I like how he does that. Huh? <laughs> I did it. <laughs> Luigi taking credit for Gooigi. Haha, <laughs> I did it. 
I enjoy Luigi's reactions in this, or like yeah, little I mean, speech he's, blurbs. It's absolutely comical, which is exactly what mm. they want. Which is good, they achieve it. Yeah, they achieve it very this well. It's supposed to be a, a fun, lighthearted game that's also occasionally very spooky. Yeah, and it, it achieves. I don't know if well. they've had any very spooky yet, but. The first Luigi's Mansion was incredibly spooky when the power goes out. Yeah, it kind of uh, is. Because then it's just it's just an endless stream of general, ghosts spawning until you uh, you actually uh, get the uh, power back on. Yeah. And it's not just like weak ghosts, like they put in the big shit wow. too. I think in general that game is just very scary. Like, imagine going in that kind of haunted mansion with, as a kid's character. Like, essentially. that That's a very different environment than you're used to in any of the previous games you know i noticed that area up there i just uh didn't know how to get there well now you do i, I, guess I like I it because you can do this then which just falls on his fucking ass <laughs> <laughs> which is the whole point oh uh well we'll be next time so uh right Oh no, shit. Oh yeah, we can. It's a little early, but we might as well. We're moving on to the next area. I guess we could do. Let's do a sneak peek. Sneak peek of the next area. Oh wait, no. Don't we have to go back? No, we don't have to go back to EGAD yet. That's right. We unlocked the floor we've already been to. Which is so weird. Uh, it's, it's just, it's, I don't know why they do this, but they do. So you can head back to, you head back to the second floor. Um, I like Luigi's bye bye uh, oh, yeah. But yeah, so now we go back to the I second floor to get another elevator button, if it ever takes us there. Okay. Bam. Alright, now next time on Skeletons. Bye-bye.